Mike at Premier Pet Supply, and today we're talking about what you do in between beds, and you suggested a really good deodorizing spray for Zen. Yeah, we've been really happy with the Scouts Honor product. We've got quite a few different options at our stores, but a lot of people just don't want to deal with bathing the dog all the time. It's so much work. It is, and then as we take them outside more, as yep. the weather breaks, they're, they, you know, they smell like outside. Mm -hmm. You know, like my mom always said, you smell like outside, take a shower. <laughs> so like what I wish I had as a kid is a little deodorizing spray for to sure. spray on, so I, I, I freshen up a little bit in without having to deal with that. But what's nice is you spray this on, it mm -hmm. also works as a detangler, which is great because yeah. it has a conditioning capability to it. So you can spray it on, you can brush it through with a brush so it really gets down into the skin and also through the coat. Just petting the dog, you know, and, and, and lathering it up. The dog mm -hmm. had no idea that, you know, you have it. You can put it on a, a towel or a washcloth or spray it on your hands before putting on the dog as well. Wait, so should you not spray directly on the dog? You absolutely can. Okay. You want to make sure you stay away from the face and from, you know, other areas that okay. might be more sensitive. My dog gets afraid of spray bottles for some reason. Sure. So I can't come at the dog with a spray bottle. Okay. So I spray it in my hands around a, on a washcloth uh -huh. and then wipe the dog down and then brush it through. Okay, that makes sense because I find Zen sneezes a lot. I guess I was maybe spraying it too close to him. Yeah, so the, the mist kind of yeah, gets in the air yeah. and that, you know, that's something that can affect you know, hmm. um, Zen or any dog or even any cat. What's really cool is that you know, a lot of companies like Earth Bath makes another one. Oh. This is a deodorizing spritz. This they, is a spritz? Yes. Yeah, so, you know, <laughs> vanilla and almond, you know, okay. those things are really good. They smell good. They're also good for the skin and coat. Okay. Um, there's also foam baths that you can do. So, oh. you you know, you work the foam into the coat uh -huh. and then you can just massage it in just like you would like while bathing. Sure. And then just towel off. So without really? having to get into a really like in-depth bath that yeah. might be, you know, you know, not something that's ideal at the time or inconvenient. So I have like really sensitive skin, so mm. I try to stay away from fragrances. All of these products have amazing scents. I mean, this one you suggest to present is Honeysuckle. Is there any danger to your pets when they are so fragrant? No, and what's really cool about that for you and for Zen is that this one in particular, the Scouts Honor, has probiotics in it. Oh. They actually benefit the skin. Okay. That work you know, in the opposite. They're not gonna dry you out. They're not gonna have an adverse reaction regarding like allergies and things like that. Uh -huh. Obviously, it depends if there's a particular ingredient that you may sure. have an adverse reaction to, but these usually help soothe and heal the skin. Okay. So it's a little, it's, it's healthier. It actually is something that is beneficial. How often would you recommend spraying? You can do it every day. Really? Yep, absolutely. Okay. Well, that's great advice. Yeah. Thanks so much, Thanks, Mike. Thanks, Priya.